Hi there, today we got a A51 Samsung LCD is broken. I believe it's gonna open from the back and shouldn't be a difficult uh, job because I see there is only one connector here. So I'm going to heat up here and then open the back cover. It wasn't that difficult because you can see that it's been replaced. I can assume and I can understand it's been replaced before. Yeah, see, screws missing. So we're going to open on the screws, but before we do that, we must remove the SIM reader because this one is going to come out like that. And then we're going to remove the front LCD. It's a single SIM phone. So Just stick your nails or a tool around it and just go all around. So it comes off. Now we can see we'll remove the battery. You try to switch it on from front if you want to. We remove this and this is the flexi of the LCD. Now we can uh, just heat up this side so we can remove it. I use sometimes water gun, sometimes normal uh, hair dryer. So I'm gonna heat up a bit. Once it is hot enough, because my screen is broken, so I'm just going to enter through any side which is accessible normally onto the broken pieces. Now we can see that this has been replaced. LCD comes off. I'm going to clean all around so when we apply fresh glue, it doesn't, uh, it fits proper. It is clean properly. This I didn't want to take out, but I did clean it all around. You can use a brush, old one, but hard one. Don't rub it onto the camera, just onto the sides. There's supposed to be a grill here for the speaker. I even checked it onto the old LCD, so most probably the guy who changed before. He didn't put it back but you look after that once you are done with this cleaning stuff uh, this LCD is like those Hawaii old ones that this ribbon is like bit flex a uh, bit flexible so just be careful when you're putting the glue now we're going to put the glue all around so we can close it I've tested the LCD please do test the LCD before you start closing it you can see with this black kilo, I'm going to go all around. You can see this uh, double tape, so fit it accordingly. I think the fingerprint sensor might not work on this LCD because it's not original. Uh, once the kilo is all around, just as I said you that this thing, sorry I forgot to record that just put the lcd in slide it in here and please 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 be careful here and uh, align it proper otherwise it won't close that flexi will come in between the, the one that i was showing you so align it from all around uh, now we're going to connect it As you can see, it's working. Now we can put. Sorry about that, not uh, showing you the fitment of the LCD, uh, but I'm sure it's not that something is very difficult. Now we can just quickly close it because I don't want the glue to get extra dry. I want to put the rubbers around it so it can hold properly. This glue is outside, not inside. So you can see the LCD is working. And now we're going to just put quickly screws. Put some glue on the edges of the back cover. Or sticky double tape if you don't want to put the glue. Avoid the aerials. I normally don't put on them. Put the back cover. And then I'll just put the rubbers around it but just to show you the LCD is working so this is basically how you replace LCD on a 51 Samsung 
please subscribe my channel if there are any question please uh, ask me in the comments thank you very much please give it a thumbs up share the video i need subscription please guys help me thanks a lot until next time goodbye